Welcome back to Magic Tarot. This is Jasmine with a reading for the zodiac sign of Virgo for June 2019. I have pre shuffled the cards and I have three cards sitting here in front of you. The first one is the Ten of Swords. The second one is the Queen of Pentacles. And the third is the Two of Swords. Okay, for the first one, this one looks pretty graphic. You see a man laying here with knives in his back and he pretty much looks dead. Okay, so the, when you get this card, it represents the end of a cycle. Um, you could be ending a cycle with a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, that's wrong. With a Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. And it looks like that um, this already could have happened or is about to happen in the month of June. Okay, because this is a June reading. So whenever you get this card, it could be that you, you might be getting a divorce. Some of you might be getting a divorce or quitting a job. Um, but something has reached um, its conclusion where you know you have to end it. You might be ending it with a Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius because you don't see no life left in the relationship or the situation. You might not see no life left in your job. So you're you're quitting that. You might be quitting that as well. Well, or some of you might be set, um, suffering a sudden misfortune is what I'm hearing. Um, and there could have been some type of loss, some type of deep loss. There also could be someone uh, about to go through some type of legal situation or some type of social situation that's coming to an end. Um, this card represents a karmic cycle has come to an end. A lot of you are ending things because you want a different lifestyle. Something new is about to come in. But you know that the final uh, chapter of this situation you're in has come to a conclusion and you need to put it to her rest okay so it can mean that a karmic debt is paid as well okay so the next one you have is the ace uh, i mean the queen of pentacles so this is the person that represents the taurus virgo or capricorn and um this could be you now you're the type of person that you're generous you're kind you see how she's sitting on her throne um, and she's surrounded by a lot of things. There's a little bitty rabbit down there. She's holding her coin in her hand. She's got a crown on her head. And there's trees and flowers. Everything's fruitful. So that's you. That represents you. And you're the type of person that brings home the money. You want abundance in your life. And you know that you have to bring this cycle here to a close so you can get to this situation here. Maybe this person was draining you of your finances or you weren't making enough money from your job so you put it into it. But in order to get to this point here, you have to close the cycle here. Okay, so it's showing me that you've come to that decision that you have to make that close so you can... Um, move to a higher level so you can bring in that money that new relationship or that new job so the one next to it is the card of decisions you see the woman it could be a man got his back turned to the water and the water is rough it's not smooth and there's jagged little rocks meaning it's a jagged situation and his arms are crossed and he's blindfolded so that means a indecision you're not sure what decision to make where to turn because of this ending here and you want to get to this point here so you got a decision to make so in the month of june i see a lot of you virgos making a decision um, about ending some type of relationship some type of of um job or situation maybe a living situation maybe you're going through some court and and the final decision is going to come but I, uh, there is an ending. I see an ending coming in the month of June for all Virgos, or most Virgos. And um, you will be making the right decision. I feel like you will be making the right decision once you get past this cycle here, because you want to get to this place right here. You want more money, more abundance. You want a better home, living environment. I see a lot of you moving towards that direction. Um, and, and I also see some of you meeting somebody new. But you got to close that cycle out first. You know, maybe you needed to pay a karmic debt and the debt has been paid. And you're making that decision of what to do now, which way to go, where to turn. So a lot of you are going to be in deep thought, deep medication, meditation, I'm sorry. <laughs> and thinking about what your next step is, okay. So, and that's okay to do that. Um, think about what it is that you want to do, where you want to move, how you want to move forward from this point on. Close out that cycle 
I'm not telling you what to do. You know what to do. The universe is closing it out for you. If you don't close it out, the universe is going to do it for you. Because when things aren't meant to be, the universe does it for us. It, he, it closes things out for us. So that is your decision for June. You're, you're a little bit confused. Um, sometimes it's hard to let things go because you're afraid of change. And, you know, sometimes we, we get used to a situation where we don't want to move forward or we're afraid of change because we don't know what the future holds. But... Anytime a door closes and new one opens, you always got to remember that. So make your decision, make it quickly, and move forward. Keep moving forward with your new decisions because you will get to this place of abundance once that cycle is closed, okay? So don't forget to make your affirmations, write things down on paper, pray, speak things out to the universe so the universe can bring you to this point here, okay? Thank you for watching. This is just a quick reading for the zodiac sign of virgo for june 2019 come back again for another reading please like share and subscribe and i will see you next time Bye bye